What's happening everyone and welcome back to a brand new Marvel Spider-Man 2 PlayStation 5 video and in today's video I'm going to be telling you how you can unlock all of the Spider-Verse suits in the game. For those who didn't know this is the Into the Spider-Verse film and the Across the Spider-Verse film which are both animated. The suits from those films which are in the game are the Into the Spider-Verse noir suit for Peter, the Into the Spider-Verse suit for Miles, the Into the Spider-Verse SB suit for Miles, and the Across the Spider-Verse suit for Miles again. I was hoping we would get a few more suits for Peter from the Spider-Verse movies, but I'm assuming we will have to wait and see whether or not they come with DLCs, if there are any for this game. So to unlock the Into the Spider-Verse noir suit for Peter, you have to reach level 22, and it's going to cost you 50 tech parts and 4 city tokens, and there are no styles for this suit, since it's a movie inspired suit. However, this suit has custom low frame rate animations, which are incredibly cool to see in the game. I haven't actually really used this suit that much, to be honest with you. It's cool, but my favorite suit for Peter in this game is the Amazing Spider-Man 2 suit, especially since that is my favorite version of Spider-Man. To unlock the Into the Spider-Verse suit for Miles, you have to reach level 30, and it's gonna cost you 60 tech parts and two hero tokens, and again, and again, there are no styles for this suit since it's a movie inspired suit, and the suit also has custom low frame rate animations again. This is one of my favorite suits for Miles within the game. As soon as I unlocked it, it was the suit I used for quite a long time. I'm very happy to see it return, and I especially like the low frame rate animations. I think that is a really cool feature in this game for these suits. Now for the Into the Spider-Verse SB suit, you can unlock it by reaching level 33, and it's gonna cost you 70 tech parts and five city tokens. And again, there are no styles for this suit since it's a movie inspired suit, and it does have the custom low frame rate animations as well. Now this suit isn't one I would normally like, but I think it just looks really cool and it's quite different. So I have used it a little bit, especially when I first unlocked it. I think it's just a really funny suit. And it's one I like using just to mess around with, to be honest with you. So every now and again, I do put it on, but I haven't used it that much. Now for the Across the Spider-Verse suit. To unlock this, you have to reach level 44. And it's going to cost you 95 tech parts and two hero tokens. There are no styles for the suit, since it's a movie-inspired suit. And it does have those custom low frame rate animations as well. And this is probably my favorite suit for Miles in the game. It's the suit I've used the most for him. I think part of that reason is because I really like the Across the Spider-Verse film and the low frame rate animations are really cool. It can be a little bit jarring to be honest if you use it within missions, but it still hasn't put me off using this suit. There are a couple of other suits for Miles that I do really like, but I do think the Across the Spider-Verse one comes out on top for me. Now again, it's really simple and straightforward to unlock the suits within the game. The only difficult part is to actually have the tech parts, rare tech parts, hero tokens, city tokens to purchase the suits with when you do finally unlock them. And it is a bit of a shame if I'm honest with you that some of these suits are only unlockable after like level 40 because if you are focusing on the story missions you will probably complete the story before you unlock most of the suits within the game. But hopefully a new game plus mode will come out soon and you can go ahead and use all of these suits as early as you like when that mode does arrive for the game. But that is it for today's video, so please do let me know down in the comment section below if you would like to see any other videos on Marvel's Spider-Man 2. It's a really cool game and I am enjoying making these videos since I do actually like the game. If you have liked this video and you found it helpful, make sure to smash like on it to show support for the game on the channel. And if you are new to the channel, make sure to subscribe to be kept up to date with all future releases. But other than that, we'll see you in the next video.